Lisa. And we're the founders of Mint Velvet. And today we're going to be talking all things relaxed glamour. What is relaxed glamour? Effortless style. Feeling kind of grown up but sexy. It's a really good combination of our own personal styles. I tend to go a little bit sparkly. Liz loves a pair of jeans and so together it's a match made in heaven. Well it is actually quite scientific isn't it? Yeah. One part glamour. <laughs> One, One part, part relaxed. relaxed. And that equals relaxed glamour. <laughs> That's a heady cocktail. Yes. Right Actually, what we mean by that is sort of almost like that high-low dressing. So if you're going to have something glamorous, you need to put something a bit more sort of cool or just more relaxed or down with it. If you've got a sequin skirt, you wouldn't put a sexy cami top with it. You'd put a lovely, luxurious jumper to just dress that sequin skirt down a little bit and make it just look a bit more effortless. So not too much in any direction. Yes, although sometimes I do stray. I pull it back, though. <laughs> <laughs> what are the relaxed glamour style commandments? Definitely about attitude over age. So when anybody says they can't wear a certain trend, I think all trends are up for interpretation, but it is about how you make sense of them. And I think that's where we do. We do the kind of the heavy lifting. So we'll look at the trends and we'll think what's appropriate. And I think it's about finding your own style. So knowing your body, knowing what you want to play up, what you want to mm. diminish, and then really sticking to that as a formula. Have some fun. Don't think that something isn't for you because I think we've put so much work into trying to get the right thing. For example, this lovely blazer. Go a little bit oversized. You know, make it look a little bit more modern. Put it back with a pair of the latest fit jeans, which are these lovely pocket front denim. It just looks so cool. Uh, taking the trends and translating them for us. So lovely textured jacket, pairing them with a pair of straight leg jeans with the shoe of the season, which is block toe, flat pump, which again, easy, comfortable and outfit you could wear all day. We're all really time pressed, so I think one of the most important things is to have an edited collection, your foundations. Every outfit can be built on from that, mm -hmm. really, can't they? So I think it's having those forever pieces and they can go over seasons. I know that I still pull out some of our jeans that we did right at the beginning, actually. Yeah. Some things actually get better with age, don't they? So a leather jacket that's a little bit more beaten up. Great trench coat, good pair of black trousers, lovely neutral blazer, just things that really you can dress up, dress down, put with colour or neutrals, just very versatile. This is January. To be honest, this is my kind of favourite time because I love a bit of a French vibe. I love a stripe, the shape of the season, don't you think? Polo shirt collar, really important. What are your other favourites on here? I absolutely love this little... Oh, that's mine as well. Crop really cardi. That. Quality is absolutely beautiful. It's more like a little jacket, really. And again, dressed down with a pair of straight leg jeans, a little ballet pump. That's a great sort of new, comfy, everyday vibe. Like an elevated French girl style. Exactly. And talking French girl, we love all the stripes, don't we, this season? And this one is so fab because of the little crisp cotton sleeve to it. And looks brilliant under a little blazer. Like if you just want to wear it with the... How Sticking cute out. does that look? Should I tell you what I think is your style? And you can yeah. tell me what you think is yeah. my style. Yeah, yeah. That's <laughs> good. Yeah. Yeah. For Lisa, I would definitely go dress. You love a high neck. Really flattering. Got a beautiful full skirt. I think you would wear... Yeah, I'd probably still go cowboy boots. That's really how you can update the dress this season is sort of dressing them down a little bit with a And would you go cowboys. leather jacket as well just to finish Always. that? So that's you. What would you do for me? So I'm going cotton shirt. Lovely, beautiful cotton shirt, nice pair of jeans with a little bit of style. And I'd finish it off with these great Western suede boots. So one of the biggest trends is everything Chanel inspired. Beautiful little knits, flat ballet pumps, contrast black and white. It's a real sort of French vibe about it. Well, I think we all need a bit of joy in 2023. And the last two years obviously have been extremely difficult and even now everything seems so painful. The one thing I'm really hoping is that, you know, all those weddings that were cancelled will be going ahead. Whether they're doing staycations or going abroad, everyone can have fun and have joy. So important. So we're trying to make that easy for people. So we've got a great mint range, premium sort of occasion wear, beautiful dresses and beautiful suiting, fabulous beachwear range, loads of summer dresses, really focusing on these special occasions where people can just have joy. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed it. Happy shopping and more importantly, a happy new year.